What's up, guys? Classy Metal here. Um, first and foremost, uh, thanks to all the new subscribers within the last, well, I guess, week or two. There's been a ton of you come along and subscribe. I am very grateful for that. I think as of this video, I'm at, I think, 994 subscribers. I'm, I'm, I'm knocking on the door of 1,000, so... Uh, thank you guys so much for that. I, I honestly thought it would probably be, probably be next year or so before I hit a thousand, and uh, I'm already getting close to that point. So I can't thank you guys enough for that. I have a I don't even know how to cleverly or wittily uh, describe this update. I've gotten some stuff in from uh, Transcending Records, uh, Black Line Records, and actually one of you guys, a, a subscriber sent me something in the mail which I am very very grateful for um, the first thing I'm gonna show uh, the last video I did I said that I had another father befouled uh, album that I couldn't find in that update and as soon as uh, I got done recording I saw it just sitting there so I'll show that first because this uh, is a pretty strong release and also this is a uh, father befouled with enthroning desolation it has a lot of the demo type material on this and some live tracks Pretty solid stuff. If you're into Father Befouled, that whole uh, very dark death metal sound. Released on Dark Descent Records. So, sorry that didn't make it into the last video, but what can you do? At least I showed it in this one. Um, also, want to invite you guys to follow me on Instagram if you have not done so. Give you a little bit more insight into, uh, into me as a person and my life outside of just this YouTube channel. The, the metal stuff is all there. I show all kinds of metal, but you'll also see uh, just random things such as uh, food. I eat a lot, as you can tell. And uh, wrestling figures. I, uh, I, ha I recently started getting those. So definitely uh, come along and follow me over there. And let's have a good time on Instagram as well. I have a Facebook page for this channel. I will link that up under the Instagram. I will also link everything that I show in this video. And if you stay tuned, stay tuned to the end, I will have a giveaway for you guys. So just, uh, I guess, let's get this going. The first thing I guess I'll show is uh, the thing one of my subscribers, Todd Adams. Thanks, thanks a ton, man. Uh, this is actually the second thing that he sent me. He sent me a message, I guess it was a week or two ago, asking uh, for my address again saying that he had something that he wanted to send me and I was, I was like okay yeah sure he wrote me a nice letter I'm not gonna read that on here but uh thank you for the words that that you wrote on that it really meant a lot I keep all those letters and stuff they uh <clears throat> I have some of them hanging on my wall that people have sent me with things that kind of picks me up when I'm down and when I'm feeling like this uh I'm not doing a good job on this channel or something. It helps It helps kind of pick me back up. So definitely thank you so much for, for the words that you put in that letter for me. Uh, the CD that he sent me is a band out of Tennessee. It's in uh, Murfreesboro, and it's on the Artisan Era uh, label. Artisan Era has been doing some really strong stuff uh, within the, the whole little Murfreesboro, Nashville area of Tennessee. I, I recently showed the uh, Inferi, Inferi album. They just came out this year. Very strong material on that. Uh, a band that is in ties ties in with this uh, that I'm about to show. What he sent me was a uh, uh, something that I was I was un I was unaware of this uh, this band. So I'm glad that he opened my eyes to this. I believe this album, or I guess this EP, came out in 2014. They have a new one that is uh, pre-ordering right now. I think it's going to be released in June within the first couple of weeks of June. I'm definitely. After checking this out, I, I, I think I'm going to have to jump on that pre-order for that album as well. What I'm talking about is a melodic black metal outfit uh, entitled, uh, I hope I don't butcher this because I believe it's in French, Ubilet, Ubilet, I think is how you pronounce that, Ubilet, but I think it's Ubilet. And uh, the name of this EP is Apparitions. He was even nice enough to send a little thin line jewel case because it's in one of these slip discs cases that scratch your CDs up. As I said, the name of this EP is Apparitions. It's kind of melodic, uh, a tad bit symphonic, black metal. Got a, a little bit of atmospheric elements to this as well. I've only given this one listen so far, but I was blown away. Definitely uh, looking forward to spending some more time with this. And uh, I've heard, I think they have one track 
available for preview for the new album and i listened to that on bandcamp as well and it was fantastic so definitely uh, check this band out if you haven't I, like i said i'm going to link it up in the description i will leave a link to that bandcamp so you can check it out for yourself todd thank you so much for sending this to me and thank you for opening my eyes to some new stuff i'm always always finding new stuff to listen to and uh i am super thankful for that so thank you uh the next thing that i got in was from i'll do the transcending records mike over at transcending is always super generous to me i don't know why but i thank you i can't thank him enough for the stuff that uh that he does for me and for this channel so without further ado i'll show you what i ordered i pre-ordered this album and uh, I, was, I was really excited about this because i I have uh, two previous releases from this band, and they're both phenomenal. This uh, is a, a strong step forward for this band, in the, I guess, in their progression. Uh, fantastic stuff is Death Doom type metal. This is a Soliloquim, I think is how you pronounce that, with their newest release, Contemplations. Pretty dark uh, artwork on that, so hopefully the glare will cooperate a little bit. So. You can at least get an idea. Not much going on there on the back. Like I said, this just came out on uh, on Transcending Records. If you're into Death Doom, I show a, a quite a bit of Death Doom on this channel. Haven't been so much lately, but I, I do try to try to stay in the loop on Death Doom as much as possible. Fantastic stuff. This, like I said, this is a, a super strong move forward in the progression of this band. This will undoubtedly end up on my end of the year list i know that right now there's two transcending records releases that uh that have to be on the end of the year list because they're both phenomenal so uh definitely check this out like i said i'll link all this up in the description so you can check this out for yourself he always throws in some stickers some promo stickers that one actually had dog hair on it so <laughs> we try that again always throws those in for me i will include those in the giveaways that i have coming up here at the end of this video he also threw some free stuff in for me um he, he threw in the uh becoming Ock and um despondent yeah i wanted to make sure last time i said despondent it wasn't despondent despondent and becoming Ock split <laughs> and i just sneezed the dog hair i guess floating in the air got me uh the despondent side of this is entitled a light shining in darkness and the becoming Ock is congregation of snakes have not had a chance to listen to this yet as you can see it's still wrapped up still in the shrink wrap i believe it's uh <clears throat> like a double single uh two band both bands have a single uh track on this so not sure but i'm definitely looking forward to checking that out i enjoyed becoming Ock quite a bit i haven't followed them as closely as i should have i believe i have their uh debut album but I know I have one release and I enjoyed it quite a bit. So maybe that'll give me the, the kick in the pants to move forward and, and uh, get on the ball getting some more of their material. Sorry, a bit of dry, dry mouth going on. He also threw in a stack of uh, their new promo CD. I'm going to keep one of these for myself because I'm just collector scum like that. He told me to use these in giveaways to uh further i guess it's a uh, help us both out uh, it can further uh, spread transcending records stuff so you guys can check it out and it'll help my channel by getting some exposure on this giveaway so stay tuned because i'm going to throw some of those in the giveaways that i have coming up next and last but not least i have some stuff from black line records um oliver at black line just like Mike at Transcending Oliver is constantly uh, being over generous to me. I, I, he he's done so much for this channel. I don't I don't I can't say enough thank yous to either one of those guys. So thanks again. I pre-ordered the first album that I'm going to show. It just came out I think last week, and I had I did the pre-order on this. I don't show a whole lot of thrash metal. I do from time to time show thrash metal on this uh, channel, but this is a band that have no qualms showing because i actually went out and did the pre-order on this i enjoy the material on their last album and uh this one is no different it's fantastic stuff this is a defiatory with their newest release hades rising 
As I said, this is thrash metal out of Sweden. Fantastic stuff. If you haven't checked this out, I implore you to go do that. Turn the disc around. It slid around when I was listening to it earlier. Just a uh, riff city. Great stuff. Just thrash metal. I mean, it's thrash metal, and it doesn't have the little goofy uh, lyrical approach that, that irks me on thrash. I think that's why I enjoy this. It's all about the riffage, and it, it's fantastic stuff. So definitely check that out. Defiatory. Hades Rising. I did the pre-order, so I got the the little uh, pin. I don't know how well that's going to show up. Looks blurred, but it's got the album artwork on it. The camera doesn't work well. With little small things up in in front of it like that. So uh, I apologize for that. Uh, also in the pre-order, got the uh, Defiatory patch. Which is that's a it's a very sturdy thick patch it's a uh, high quality stuff on that so looks awesome as well also threw in a defiatory sticker with the album artwork that will go on my desk as I've uh, shown some pictures I think on on uh, Instagram and Facebook with the desk on there if you say that the desk is just covered in stickers and I guess I'm just gonna keep adding to that also threw in a promotional poster in that uh, pre-order bundle as well. So definitely awesome stuff there. Now, uh, moving on, he also sent me uh, an extra copy of that release that I'll get to. And he also sent me two copies of a 2017, uh, I guess, Symphonic Black Metal. This is a band, I believe they're in, out of... Uh, I want to say California, maybe Los Angeles here in the States. It's a uh, symphonic black metal. It has a few hints of death metal going on in this as well. This is a Northwind Wolves. Fantastic release. I remember he's, him sending me in a message uh, a link to some of the material. It's been, it's been a bit now. It's been a bit a while ago, and I was blown away. And uh, I remember telling him that I, I enjoyed everything I heard, and then life just kind of happened. I, didn't, I hadn't even thought about it in a bit, and... Boom, here it is in my mailbox, so I'm reintroduced to it all over again. Fantastic stuff. As I said, this came out last year. It's entitled uh, Dark, Cold, Grim. Uh, I, was, I was jamming this all morning, this morning. I've enjoyed the day off work. Actually, I have a long weekend, so it's uh, devoted to time with the, uh, the wife and the dogs and to metal. So you can't go wrong either way there. The artwork on this is just phenomenal. They... they uh, they went all out on this, on this digipack. I, I love the artwork that's in this. A uh, few atmospheric elements on this as well, not just over the top atmospheric, but uh, some atmospheric elements in that as well. As I said, he sent me in two copies, so I have an extra one. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a little giveaway for you guys. I haven't hit the uh, thousand mark. I know I said I would do my next giveaway when I hit a thousand, but I'm feeling generous today, so I'm going to do a giveaway. What I'm going to do, I know uh, black metal and thrash metal quite a bit apart. So I know some of you that are into thrash may not be so much into black and vice versa. So I'll do two separate giveaways on this. What I'll do is the uh, Northwind Wolves, and I'll throw one of these Transcending Records compilations. It's got, the, the, the compilation has uh, a little bit of everything on it. It has uh, Vesperian Sorrow, a band that I talk about quite a bit on this uh, channel. It's got uh, tracks from Soliloquim, which I just showed. Um, all kinds of stuff. Frost Giant, another really strong release from this year. So, I have the uh, Northwind Wolves and the Transcending Sampler, and I'll throw in a couple of those Transcending stickers in that one. And then I'll do Defiatory and another transcending sampler with that and the other couple of stickers so i have two giveaways going all you have to do to enter is just in the comments say uh i guess uh, i want defiatory or i want northwind wolves i will draw a winner let's see what's the day the 26th i'll do it on june 15th if that sounds fair to you guys and i'll do a video for that draw it out and you can win either one so just let me know which one you want defiatory or northwind wolves and i'll throw that transcending sampler in that with it in there with that as well so yeah that's all i've got for today uh todd man thank you so much for the for the cd you sent me mike oliver i thank you guys all the time and i guess i'm going to keep on thanking you guys thank everybody that watched this 
Stay classy, stay metal, and I'll see you all very soon.